Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm glad to see you all here and thanks so much for watching my videos. In this video I will talk about how to buy a car and I will share my experience how I bought my first used car in Canada. So let's get started. To start with you need to understand that you can buy the car from the official dealership directly. You can buy a, a car from a person like uh, for example on Kijiji or on Facebook and you can buy also on the auction. Uh, so this is a very interesting topic. I do not have unfortunately experienced buying there a car but my friends bought a car in auction and the thing is that there could be a car like for one thousand dollars two thousand dollars but you can check it you can try it you can check it so you are buying like a kinder surprise i had some uh, friends that uh, did it and they had a very good um offer and but they were lucky i know that someone uh, bought a car and was not lucky at all because then they spend much much more uh, money on repair than the car cost itself so this is something that could be very risky and tricky but sometimes you can win like a lottery and uh, the last one is you're buying the car uh, from the wholesale uh, origins uh, so this is like um, a place where you can buy a used car and all a car available in one place and you are just walking uh, through and looking which car you like or not you can read and have some uh, specific informations about this car like how much kilometers it has uh, like what year and so on it's open like 24 hours a day and uh, like during the day uh, like working hours you can uh, test this car and have a ride across uh, the area and in this video I will share uh, my experience buying a car on the wholesale origins because I bought it there and I know how it looks like so I can share with you so I was monitoring uh, the car on their website and on the Facebook marketplace but a mind that uh, the Facebook marketplace it's more dated so for example the car I bought it was on the marketplace uh, but it was not yet on the website and they can change very very quickly so please do not think that if you see a very good offer it will not last long uh, i remember that i w we wanted to buy a car we came in the evening we tried it we really like it and the next day we thought uh, we will come early and buy a car but we came it was open from nine and uh, we came at 10 and the car was not there so someone bought it like immediately so just mind that if you like some car just uh, do it really quickly so how the process look like so you can ask uh, a salesman please can i try this car he will give you the key you will take a short ride if you like this car then you can take this car and for a check to your auto mechanic uh, or to if you have some services i would definitely recommend you to find some um, very trusted person uh, that will show you uh, and give you the real price and estimation how much a repair of this car will need like uh, just to see the overall picture so we took our car uh, to the auto mechanic he checked it says it's a very good deal you can definitely take it there is a slight repairs needed but don't worry so we went back uh, to the wholesale uh, origins and say that okay we want to buy a car and he said okay I will like book this for you you can come back um, like next day and buy it because it was the evening so the next day we took our just credit card and uh, like our IDs and that's it uh, so the procedure of buying a car is very quickly and they just give you the fill out form and that's it they give us the the document for the car and they have only the insurance for the one day so during this one day what you will need to do you will need uh, to buy an insurance 
for your car because you will not allow to drive a car without the insurance so they have their own uh, insurance that we can use for one day and uh, you will need to make an MVI this is the motor vehicle um, safety check for your car so we just had the one day to do this MVI and to do this insurance uh, so you should do everything very quickly we gave our car to the services they were repairing some stuff and uh, they already did an MVI because some car services have the authority and the license to give you this MVI sticker so this is a, like a piece of paper and but they also will give you a small sticker that this car is good to go for one year and you need to put this stick on your front window the next thing is to register your motor vehicle uh, so what will you need to do uh, what you will need to have insurance the MVI the document uh, for the car and this is basically all you go uh, to the access Nova Scotia you need to have all of these documents they will give you the plate and uh, the sticker uh, for this plate and this is basically is the procedure itself of registration the motor vehicle is really fast and very easy you can find all the information on their website like what documents you will need or what you need to provide and to pay the fee and that's it oh and one i remember just one uh, thing that when you're buying the uh, car you can also negotiate the price uh, we negotiated I think maybe $500 something like that because sometimes they can give you some discount and uh, if you say that okay this is the receipt from the car services and they told that like to repair this car you need uh, or to have a safety check you need to fix this and this and this and it costs like for example $1,000 uh, they can make you some even bigger discount because you're buying the car and investing a lot so sometimes they can give you discount so just use it it's better like to ask and to have a discount than not to ask and do not have a discount so this is basically all I wanted to cover in this topic if you still uh, have some questions just let me know and thanks guys for watching my video see you soon bye